Yo, what's good, everybody? How y'all doing? How y'all doing? I know uh, I don't post videos as much as I used to. Like back in the day, I used to post a lot of videos, like back to back. It might be two, three on the same day. Now you might get one ever, ever blue moon. That's when you grow up, man. Shit. I mean, it's just got a lot of things going on right now. You know, I'm visiting my best friend, so um, we're chilling. Um, just relaxing. It's now a day off. I wasn't feeling that well. Um, my asthma was messing with me like really bad. Um, I was wheezing in my sleep. My breathing stopped a little bit. So I'm okay. I got an inhaler. Y'all calm down. <laughs> you know, I already know y'all be like, you sure you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. I'm all right, you know. I'm a trooper. I bounce back. Like that. You know. I ain't gonna let shit get to me. You know what I'm saying? I'm not on that level of letting shit get to me anymore. I'm starting to cipher, write, meditate, go to meetings, and just doing it. The damn thing, you know. I ain't gonna be no saint overnight. You know. That's the same thing like Steve Harvey said. You know, God ain't done with me, yeah. so I'm going to have flaws and all that. It ain't going to be perfect overnight. It's going to take some time. It feels so good out here today. I really am so thankful to my higher power. It did feel so good out here. You see what I got on now? Uh, it ain't nothing. I ain't rocking like that. I got to get my shit from my brother's house, you know, but still doing the red, black, and white. <laughs> Uh, man, I'm just enjoying the weather. I'm enjoying that my day off is started today, which is Friday. And I'm just listening to music. I'm happy for a certain person that they're happy now. And, you know, and I'm happy, you know. It takes time take time for things to change take time for things to get healed nothing gets healed overnight it takes time nothing happens overnight it takes time patience is what comes to virtue if you have patience you can get through so much shit you know one thing about us people black people we have little patience for tolerance we have so much little patience for shit when we want it right then and there you ever, yeah, y'all already know I cut my hair. Yeah, I don't mind it's the band-aid, sorry. We ain't talking about that. Um, we do, we have lack of patience. You ever um, wanted a package to come right then and there? I know I've been through that when I was wanting my tea to come like right then, like right now. Where's my testosterone? Testosterone, you should be here. Well, how many days has it been? Oh shit, it ain't coming today. You know? I was like, damn, I had to think about that a little bit. Like, oh, well, fuck. Oh, Kamari, you got another motherfucking week for it to come. Shit! And we be mad as fuck. I be mad as fuck. I be mad. When it comes to testosterone, y'all know if you're a trans man and you waiting for that testosterone or to get your script, you ever get your script and you be up all night long waiting for that one fucking prescription just to get your testosterone. But a nigga, I need my testosterone. Fuck. I can't wait. Oh, it's the day before I'm going to get my prescription. Oh, shit. I can get a feel. Oh, shit. You be like, damn, yeah, all right. You know, facts. We don't know. We lose our damn mind when we get a prescription. Feel. We think it's Christmas. Like Christmas comes to us when we get our new prescription. Like when we almost run out, we buy paranoid as hell. Oh fuck no! I'm not finna go through all that shit. Oh hell no! Finna no. Uh, not finna feel all kind of side effects and ways and feminine and all that shit. No 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 no! I'm a goddamn man. I don't want to feel some missile. Fuck out of here! Fuck out of here! Then. Y'all just get your little prescription and shit filled. We think it's Christmas. Oh, Jingle Bell. Jingle Bell come to us. 
We think we done won the fucking lottery. Nigga be turning up because we got a prescription. Nigga, we throw bottles. I throw a Coke. Shit. Oh, my bruise is showing a lot more. I've had this bruise for so long. I've had this bruise since I was a kid. It reminds me constantly when I went through the battles of when I was younger. And it stuck with me. Always on my face. That's the reason why I'd be so paranoid about my face. When I got this bruise, I flipped the fuck out. You don't understand how bad I flipped out when I was a kid. I was so angry, so mad when I was a kid about this fucking scar. But, you know, it's a battle scar. Battle wounds. They heal. That's like us. As people. We heal. We might go through a lot of bullshit in the world. We might hate a lot of people. We might get mad at a lot of people. Fuck that nigga. Fuck that. Fuck that bitch. Fuck her. I don't want to fuck with her no more. Fuck you, ho. Fuck, 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 fuck. We always say fuck. But we heal. My lips are peeling like fuck. Like, so seriously. Carmax, it been through war. Don't judge me. It's still something in here, so I don't care. I'm going to use it. Hold on. I don't want y'all to watch me put my chef stick on. Okay, I'm back. Now, there is a certain amount of chef stick that you can put on your lips. Now, if you've been eating some church's chicken and you got Carmax on your lips, sweetie, you don't need no motherfucking Carmax because church's chicken got so much grease on it. Shit. It put chapstick on your lips. The grease actually lubricates your fucking lips. And if you're in the hood, you know about Church's Chicken. If you've been in certain areas in Atlanta, you know about that Church's Chicken. <laughs> That's that nightmare when you kind of been tipsy, been drinking, you on a budget. Church's Chicken right around the corner. Now, if you on an upper place like here, which is North Atlanta, where she stay, and I stay in Atlanta... You ain't gonna find no church's chicken downtown Atlanta. Now you gotta take your ass all the way up. Bankhead. Now if you're trying to get some seafood with EBT card, take your ass all the way over the east side, west side, mm -mm. and maybe a little piece of north side. Like you can't go all the way down to the airport and you can't go all the way down to certain areas and think you're gonna get Foods, use your food stamp card for free seafood. Uh, no, not gonna happen. Uh uh. But you bring your ass north, there ain't no church's chicken. Don't, don't think that you come to Marietta, there's a church's chicken around in Marietta. Don't think there's a church's chicken over there in Roswell. White people are here. Ain't no goddamn church's chicken in Roswell. Ain't no even church's chicken in Marietta. Ain't no church's chicken in Sandy Springs. White people. They like church's chicken, but they ain't gonna put no church's chicken over there. Because they said we hood. It is what it is, man. Fuck that. I'm happy. I'm doing good. I'm feeling a little bit better. I was kind of under the weather. Um... My best friend, we got in an argument for a little bit, but, you know, we'll be all right. We're going to swap. I stopped in trying to be her, like, big brother and shit. I had to check myself. Some people don't need a big brother. Some people just need you just to be there for them. And she's very needy. She's an Aries. So, y'all be needy as fuck. Y'all some thirsty fucking people. My sign, I don't know how to let go when I lost something good. It's hard for me to break out with somebody that I really give a fuck about and go on my merry way because my son is so attached to that person. I'm a Sagittarius. We can be assholes. I know I'm an asshole. My son's very much an asshole. I agree. I'm an asshole sometimes, but I have a good heart. But if you ever come to me wrong, bust your ass, I'll tell you that. Real shit cute, but I'll bust your ass. I'm that nigga. I'm still street. But you know about that. But, um, y'all, I'm gonna let y'all go. 
Uh, video got too long, and it probably is killing my little bit of data I got. <laughs> but, uh, hope everybody's having a good day. Hey, has my voice dropped? Can anybody tell me, has my voice dropped any lately? Please, can you tell me? Because I can't really hear myself. All right, later, guys.